Simple ideas can turn out into something big. I say that a lot and I have hundreds of examples to prove it. And in today's video, we have a really cool example and a really cool entrepreneurial story on Shopify here from a $2 million per year brand. This brand that you see on my screen did 2 million last year and it's handmade deodorant, organic natural deodorant. And it's pretty cool. So. We're gonna go over everything. We're gonna go over their exact strategy. We're gonna go over all their sales channels. And actually, it's pretty cool. The founder who I just followed here, John Larkin, he's pretty open about the numbers. And I love to see that. I love to see also that they're popping off on Amazon. They're getting a huge returning customer rate. So this sounds like an extremely healthy business. And hopefully, you're gonna be able to get a lot of insights from it. So as you see here, they have a lot of stuff. They have a lot of products and their website, I'm gonna actually try to look at it in mobile view here just to see um, if it's better. And it is, I mean, this is pretty nice. It's not like your traditional Shopify store look. I would say it's a little bit more old feeling, but it also feels organic and trustworthy at the same time. So it actually kind of fits the brand quite well. Uh, so that's great. Now let's read about this product here because this is the bundle, the triple crown edition that is their best seller. This, by the way, is a really genius way to sell these kinds of products, right? Because you're able to increase your average order value with low ticket products. That's super smart. If you have products like this that are lower ticket, but you can bundle them together and create this, you know, sort of triple crown edition, that's what they call it, bundle, then you're gonna be able to spend a little bit more on advertising and acquire customers more profitably. So as you see here, basically what's going on is they took all their best sellers and put it into one bundle, super smart. And as you see, they really talk about how they make the product because this guy makes it himself. So as you see here, unlike some of those others out there we actually cure all our soaps for four weeks before shipping them to our fulfillment center in the usa yes this means we will sometimes be out of stock and will grow slower than other brands however this means they will be in perfect condition for you to use and they will last more than three to four showers on average if cared for our soaps last two weeks or more so that's pretty cool i really think these guys have a cool plan that they've set out where they know exactly what they want. They're not trying to grow the fastest or be the biggest. They're trying to be the best, like in terms of quality. So that's what they talk about here. First time customer guarantee. If you're a first time customer and don't like your soap or deodorant for whatever reason, get in touch and we guarantee we'll do our best to make it right for you. Whether that's via refund, different product or gift card, we will do whatever it takes to try to ensure you are happy. This is really good customer service. And it just brings trust. Like literally that badge alone probably makes some people convert. It seems like they are shipping everywhere, which is cool. And I mean, yeah, that's kind of about it on the website side. Now let's look at their ads because they actually are running a ton of Facebook ads, uh, which is no surprise to me because my business runs Facebook ads and we do it for million dollar a month brands and more, even some TikTok shop brands that are doing multiple millions a month now, which I'm very excited about to be working with. Uh, but you know, they're, doing a lot of stuff here and actually the way i found this brand initially was through the Akemulab discord and in the discord they showed our researcher team our research team showed that these guys are kind of a potential competitor for dr sasquatch not really because those guys are bigger and huge and they're not really doing the same thing or targeting the same niche uh, but they're starting to advertise a lot is what i what we mean by that so as you see they got some really interesting looking ads. They just look so raw, right? They, it, you know, they have a frame here that kind of stands out. Handmade natural soap. Lads, the days of synthetic body washes and anti-perspirants are officially over. We're bringing back soap. It's 100% natural, blah, 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 blah. Really, really good. Trusted by 20,000 other blokes who were once just as skeptical as you. So I love the brand identity that they're going with. It's just, like I said, a very raw and natural feeling. It doesn't feel like a massive brand it feels like a small business that just wants to do things right and that's why it converts so well but just because they're a small business doesn't mean they're letting that stop them from just testing a ton of content i mean obviously this is a lot of inactive ads but you can see that they spent a ton of time really optimizing for the best possible ads that they can have and that's really the key to success with meta is getting really granular with your testing and going above and beyond to make sure that you're always producing new content. Um, and they actually do this across all social media, which is so smart. There's no reason you shouldn't be posting about your product because it's literally free to post. And now all of these videos that they have, 
um, are not only going to be seen by their community, but by other people in the world. And also they can be amplified via ads. So that's sort of the playbook that we follow. And then, of course, they're on Amazon, which I think is a great idea for brands. I think you should be on Amazon for multiple reasons. One, their fulfillment network is amazing. Two, they provide you with customers as well. If you're doing well, their marketplace will flood your orders like you'll get a ton of orders basically and honestly even all of the efforts that you produce outside of amazon are gonna be compounding on amazon too if you're running facebook ads to shopify you're still gonna get amazon growth from that um, and we love to see that right i think the next step for these guys is probably tiktok shop if i were to advise them it would be to get on tiktok shop asap whether it's tiktok shop uk tiktok shop us or both it's gonna be massive and it really pairs well with Amazon and Shopify, so no reason not to do it. But that's it for this video. I'll see you in the next one. Peace.